Welcome back YouTube to Rick's YouTube channel. Today's video, I'm going to show you how you can get helicopters on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Now, these are third party developed aircraft for the game. It's a massive community. Uh, I'm going to show you quickly where to go and find these aircraft and also how to download them and actually put them into your community folder. Now, you will have to have some special software for the helicopters, just for the flight controls to make them actually work. If you don't run the program, you're not going to be able to fly the chopper very well. So, we're on Microsoft Flight Simulator. I always use, we'll go over to flightsim.2. So, this is where you're going to get your third party libraries, aircraft, scenery from. Make sure you sign up, give the developers a uh, love. And also pay where to you know pay for some of the uh, the excellent aircraft that are being developed so you want to go to aircraft uh, but the first one you'll go to is military and you can see the h60 the uh, black Hawk paved load whatever you want to call it is there so that's one of the aircrafts if you keep scrolling through c17 is a remarkable aircraft it really is good for for absolutely free so yeah make sure you give the developers uh, a lot of love big shout out to destroyer 121 uh, he's making a lot of cool things at the moment uh, so if you go to uh, other aircraft you can see you've got a robertson r44 from roto sim pilot and various other you know the jetpack uh, the paper plane just some cool stuff to download so if we go back to the H Sikorsky H60 under military, and we'll click on this one here. And it does say that you will need to run the Airlands FS application before it. Don't worry about that. It will download automatically when you hit the download button just there. You'll just have to run the program. So what usually happens is a zip file uh, you have to unzip it to the community folder so make sure you've got WinZip or something like that and then extract it to the community folder so if I go into my files now I'm going to locate where I've installed Microsoft Flight Simulator I've got it here the packages then Microsoft Flight Simulator local cache packages and then that's my community folder there so anything that I download that's third party I extract it to my community folder so that's what you do with a helicopter uh, there'll be two files one will be the airlines FS uh, extract and run that then start up Microsoft Flight Simulator, then load your helicopter, and then you'll be able to use the helicopter in Microsoft Flight Simulator. So if you do have any problems, there is a comment box below. Let me know if you're having problems. I'll try and help you out. If you're new around here, I do make Microsoft Flight Simulator videos. So please leave a like, subscribe, and I shall get back to you with another one. Thanks for watching.